Good morning. Welcome to another edition of Talking Shit. I'm DeAndre on the commentary this morning. Uh, welcome. It's early. I'm early. I'm up. Uh, I'm frustrated. I got the word that uh, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has made it to uh, your country too. He is here in America. Uh, BB is on the uh, on the scene. Uh, uh, a man that's real, real mean. I was listening to some commentary on CNN this morning uh, in regards to the fact that this man does not represent the entire Jewish population on the planet. He is the prime minister of one country and speaks for all people who are descendants from that country, he believes. He then brought his motherfucking ass over here to our country, uh, the people who give them over $3 uh, billion a year, $120 billion in the last 15 to 20 years, uh, and this motherfucker gonna come here and talk shit to us. I do not have any respect for this man. Uh, he is trying to sabotage the ongoing uh, talks with Iran, uh, with uh, Secretary uh, Kerry and his counterpart, uh, the defense minister from Iran, to uh, broker a deal in regards to scaling back uh, the nuclear drumbeat. And, you know, Benjamin is trying to manipulate American policy by way of John uh, Boehner's ass, who should be impeached and brought up on treasonous uh, charges for obstruction uh, of the nation's business, for uh, sabotaging, and, and he doesn't even really have any control over his own party. Uh, the extreme uh, right wing of the Republican Party has uh, vow to continue to cause harm and threat and danger in our country by not financing uh, the Department of Homeland Security. John Boehner is uh, political and uh, sociological and uh, dangerous uh, risk uh, to our country as uh, Chairman, uh, Speaker of the House, rather, Ian. It's really sad that he has now included the government and or politics of Israel to further enhance his no-brainer-ass attitude uh, uh, with us and acting like we're beneath him. I've seen his sort of smirks and his <laughs> and all his bullshit that he uh, does out at the camera uh, when we're trying to address this motherfucker on the well-being of our country. As Speaker of the House, he's been a louse. He's loused it up. He's lousing it up. You're fucking it up, John. Uh, BB, uh, you know, let me tell you something real quick, uh, Mr. Netanyahu. We don't need your motherfucking bullshit. What we need is validation on what you're doing with all that money we're giving your asses while you and your wife is over there paying all these slave wages and stuff to people for cleaning y'all's fucking homes and stuff. Uh, at the same time, not really surpassing the basic income of most uh, people in Israel uh, on, on how much it takes for us to clean y'all's house. So in lieu of housekeeping for the Netanyahu's and in lieu of them trying to manipulate the uh, drumbeat of nuclear uh, protection in the Middle East, uh, we don't, I don't trust the Israeli government. I don't believe that all Jews are being spoken for uh, by Benjamin Netanyahu. And I believe that, you know, we need to silence his motherfucking ass by way of breaking the Internet. Let's break the Internet. When that motherfucker is speaking, make a video. You know, I challenge you. If you're looking at this video during the time the Netanyahu is running his motherfucking mouth trying to put us down and make us feel like we're some sort of international clown as they keep giving us uh, all these lies to throw money down as they kill the people in Gaza, as they persecute the Palestinians, as they take the fucking money and do whatever they want. I say we break the internet. Let's shut this motherfucker down by way of not even listening. Let's turn our back to his distorted facts. He and John Boehner are full of shit. You know, they need to lie in bed with the Fox News team and get what they get. They need to go play around with Bill O'Reilly's motherfucking ass and do the things that don't last. We are a people and a humanity. 
that don't need this kind of insanity. We got too much shit going on over here. And then somebody gonna tell me on Twitter that when I said that we need to get the fucking three billion dollars back, that I mentioned only communities that can use the money to have black people in them. Listen, this is 2015. The motherfucking president is half white. No stupid ass. That money that we give Israel can be used everywhere, from California to Chicago, from New York to New Jersey, from North Carolina to over there by your mama. I don't care. We need the money. We don't have it to give away so they can kill all those people in Gaza anyway. It don't matter where they spend the money. Hell, ship it to Ukraine. Ain't that many black folk over there. If you're upset about black people progressing, this motherfucker on Twitter. You know, all these bullshitters. When are we going to change, right? When is it going to work? You know, John Kerry is trying to work with the Iranian people. This is the closest we've ever been to being close to them uh, truly being some sort of sick friend, you know. <laughs> Iran could be like the uncle you roll in with the pocket protector at the family gatherings or something. <laughs> well, we need to do something other than Israel bitching that we ain't doing nothing. I think that's bullshit, and they take the fucking money. They got the goddamn money. They're taking the money. They're getting the money. They're taking the money. They get the money. You know, they want the money. He's coming over here to speak to assure the money. He sure we need to break the fucking internet. I say turn your back toward his distorted facts. Turn your back toward his distorted facts. PP can't CC. He don't speak for a lot of the Jewish people or me. It's like a BB. BB. Call your motherfucking ass on BB. Go home, you know. Go home and take care of your kids. <laughs> BB, go home, take care of your kids. Sound like a big black lady in the projects that sells weed. BB, BB, go home and take care of your kids. You know? <laughs> no, I'm just sick of him. He come over, he's going to try to tell us what to do and how to spend the money, too. You know, we need to do what we're supposed to do as a country. I think Barack Obama is taking an excellent attitude toward his lack of gratitude. And then he going to expect us to follow Israel's mood? We are a sovereign state. We're trying to help y'all motherfucking ass. I say cut off the ATM card. I don't want to do the apprehension, the torture, and the murder upon the Palestinian people. Cut off the ATM card. Turn your back on this fucking, uh, uh, this liar. I think he's a liar. He's a manipulator. He's a middle masturbator toward real peace. The man don't want no real peace. He come upon an era of fear. You know, and more and more youth from Jew Jerusalem, more and more the young people from Israel, more and more the young Jews here, uh, American Jews, we don't buy his views. He is a lying tissue of bullshit. We need to break the internet and turn our back toward his distorted facts. Fuck the fact that, uh, fuck the fox. <laughs> fuck the fox news. <laughs>